Yo, 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 what's up? This your boy M Breezy back at it again, man, like I always do around this time. What's up, YouTube? What's up, Cowboy Nation? Let's get right into it. Let's get right into it. Hey, man, it's that time of the year. It's the time of the year when you put up or shut up. Ain't no more next week. If you lose this week, ain't no more his fault. It was his fault. It was his fault. No, it ain't none of that. Time to put up or shut up. The Cowboys are in a perfect position to reach the NFC Championship game. I don't know who's going to be there, but more than likely, it'd probably be the 49ers. But, man, it, the road to the championship game in the NFC can't get no better than this. Can't get no better than this. The NFL auto gave us an olive branch uh, uh, Saturday night against Detroit Lions. Put us in the position to reach the NFC championship game because we can only play good at home. Because on the road, we are a horrible team against the run and, and can't score, uh, uh, put up enough points. On the road to win a game for nothing to save our lives. Except for the last game of the season, we played the Washington Commanders. We had four rookies in the secondary. Defense alignment hurt. Uh, it just it was a hey, cakewalk. It was a cakewalk all day long. And did you see Dak Prescott in there in the fourth quarter trying to uh, get those, start, try, trying to stat pad? Did you see him trying to stat pad? When I went down there and didn't get no field goal or nothing? Or did, he, or did he miss the field goal or did he uh, kick the field goal? I know it, it, it was one of the. I don't think they got anything out of the drive. But he tried to stat pad. Should have been talking about the game. Mike McCarthy and Dak Prescott tried to stat pad against the Washington Commanders Sunday night. Well, Sunday evening uh, game. But nevertheless, man, Dak Prescott was uh, uh, once in the MVP hunt along with Brock Purdy. Those are the two, only two quarterbacks over there in the NFC right now that are playing good football. So it should not be a problem. For us to get to the NFC Championship game and face the San Francisco 49ers if they're there. I'm just saying. Hey, man. We got to get there. The path can't get no easier than this. We got the 9-8 Green Bay Packers. They just did make it by winning the last game of the season. Now, John Love and the, uh, 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 and the Packers are playing good ball. They are playing real good football. And they beat the uh, Detroit Lions down on Thanksgiving night, Thanksgiving Day. So, hey. Any given day, any given day, any given day, anything can happen. So I just hope one. Of the, I hope just this this Sunday is not one of them days for uh, things to go bad for the Dallas Cowboys. Because hey, this is nine eighteen, and we are at home. This should be a cakewalk. We should be a. I mean, we should beat these boys. We should score forty points because y'all we we score forty points all the time at home. So it should be a forty point game. Should be a forty point game. And like I said, this is the playoffs. Palm get sweaty and, and, and do don't get tight and palm get sweaty like mom's spaghetti. Y'all know the old saying. Y'all know the whole saying. It's time to put up and shut up. And Jerry Jones has got two home. Just imagine Jerry Jones. When was the last time the Dallas Cowboys had two home games in the playoff? Do you know how much money Jerry Jones is going to make if the Cowboys win both of, the, both of these games and go to the championship game? If the Cowboys, they should, which they should. Now, Jerry Jones said on the uh, 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 at one of the uh, press conference said that they asked him a question about Mike McCarter, what is the future in Dallas? And Jerry Jones still didn't show no uh, uh like he no favorite towards resigning Mike McCarthy. He said, let's see how it's gonna go. We're playing good ball right now. Uh uh, uh but let's see how we're gonna let these couple of games go. That was Jerry Jones said about when he asked about Mike McCarthy. Jerry Jones want this money, man. Jerry Jones want these two games at home right here. Jerry Jones will rake up the Dallas Cowboys. Two home games to play. Oh, come on. Money, money, money. Money. And check this out. Not only will we play John Love, rookie, first time uh, uh, in, in the playoff, and after that, just say, for instance, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers beat the Philadelphia Eagles. Just say for sake, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers beat the Philadelphia Eagles. Do you know that's another 9-18 coming down here, come out here to the division game in, in Jerry World, Tampa, Baker Mayfield? Do you see how they're playing right now, Baker Mayfield? This would be a cakewalk. Hey, they, might, hey, they might rump the Tampa Bay Buccaneers because Baker Mayfield and the Tampa Bay look horrible uh, last uh, uh, Sunday against Carolina Panthers. I know it's a vision game. I know how that goes. But, man, he look horrible. Horrible. So, there should be two cakewalks. Two cakewalks. You was an MVP candidate one time. Jordan Love, Baker Mayfield. But, here's what things get real interesting. Real interesting. Just say the Rams beat the Detroit Lions and Philadelphia Eagles beat the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Do you know that the Eagles are coming back to AT&T Stadium to play the Dallas Cowboys because the Buccaneers, uh, because Fortnite had a lower seed? They'll play the Rams. They're a division opponent too. Two division opponent games. It can go either way. 
This is where it get very interesting at. This will get very, very interesting at, man, right here. This is where it get, this is where it get good at. Just imagine the Eagles come back here to have another shot at beating the Dallas Cowboys and knocking us out the playoff. Oh, my God. Man, would you, hey, do you know how much of an insult? Do you know, do you know how much embarrassment that will be? Dude, I'm just saying. This could be a scenario. I'm just saying. Uh, then you got Detroit. They beat the Rams. They come back. AT&T Stadium. I played the Dallas Cowboys because the 49ers still had the lower seed. It probably would be the uh, uh, Philadelphia Eagles. I think the Eagles going to beat Tampa Bay. It's going to be 49ers, Eagles, Cowboys, Detroit Lions. And the, oh, the, the mysterious call on the two-point conversion. All that drama going to come back around. All that drama going to... Do, do you, can you imagine the hype? Uh, it's going to be for the Dallas Cowboys. Man, do you know we're going to be buzzing around? Hey, man, Dallas Cowboys... It's about to be hot as fire these next two weeks if they can get these, get to the championship game. It's gonna be on fire, man. It's gonna be on fire. And the defense, hey, what what uh? I didn't hear nobody talk about the defense. Defense uh, lost the game. Defense didn't do this. Defense, didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't, I'm just saying, I ain't hear nothing about that. Uh, we had a lineman. We had what two offensive linemen that didn't play. Uh, uh I ain't hear nothing about that neither. But anybody sitting by the uh, the two linemen that was out and that pressure out against sight and uh, we couldn't run the ball and this that and the third because guess what. We played the Washington Commander with a bunch of backups. Beat the brakes. Hey, beat the brakes off of them. Which we should have did. Which we should have did. Don't get me wrong. Which we should have did, and they did. Dak Prescott, it's time to shine. You and Mike McCarthy. Hey, man. Y'all got to put up a shit up. Y'all got to put up a shit up. Y'all, hey, look. Y'all got to get to the championship game, man. Because, boy, if you don't get to the championship game, do you know what this is going to do to both of y'all careers, Mike McCarthy and Dak Prescott? Do you know how much the media, man, don't like? Hey, look, man. Prescott, now, you know me. Now you got to, you got to prove to me, cause I just don't believe in you. I don't want you to fail, man. I want you to win because the media will eat you alive if you don't reach this NFC Championship game. And you were once in the MVP race, and you got a home game. Don't lose at home. You got two home games. That's gonna be another insult. Hey, man. <laughs> It's time to put up a shut up. It's time to put up a shut up. And, 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 and then here another story. Mike McCarthy, he was the coach of the Green Bay Packers. He won a Super Bowl with the Green Bay Packers in 2011 at AT&T Stadium, which he now coaches that Dallas Cowboys at. And they're going to play in the playoff game this weekend. And there go another story. Mike McCarthy. Oh, my God. Hey, now Detroit coming. Hey, hey, Green Bay coming in here? Don't think now. Hey, don't let these young boys get hot. Because we, we, never, played, we never played these Green Bay Packers. We played the Aaron Rodgers Green Bay Packer last year in Laws. But this young man right here, hey man, this young man right here, John Love, he looking, he looking real good. That's all I got to say, he looking real good. But I don't think he's going he gonna to come in here and do nothing to the Dallas Cowboys. I don't think. It, I, it, hey, it's it going to have to be a catastrophe for the Dallas Cowboys to lose this game. Gets a 9 18. was the first time a quarterback in the, in the playoff, period. Come on now. Come on now. Dallas Cowboys. The time is now. Hey, all that. Let's see. What, all the wait the next week. It's none, none of that. You, you, hey. The winner keep moving, the loser go home. The loser go, hey, this is pressure. Pressure, 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 pressure. Hey, man, this is pressure, man. I'm telling you, these are the moments I live for. This is what I want to see. This is what I want to, this, and this is what I call football, football. All that regular season stuff, out the way. Because guess what? We were 12 and 5 again. Can you believe that? We were 12 and 5 again, man. The same record for the last past two years when Kelly Moore was called to play. Can you believe this? Can you believe this? Hey, man, come on. That's what Jerry Jones is saying. Jerry Jones is saying we've been 12 and 5 for the last past three years. I, I'm paying you to get me to the Super Bowl. Can you do that? I'm paying you to get me to the Super Bowl. Or Mike McCarthy, that's what I'm paying you to do, get me over that hump. Now, see, Dyke Prescott had Kelly Moore. They said uh, Kelly Moore was not the guy for Dyke Prescott. So I let, 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 I let Kelly Moore go. You say you're going to run this offense different, but it's the same old offense to me. Same old clock mismanagement. Mike McCarthy, you're the same old coach. You are the same. Don't let David LaFleur come in here, man, a, a, a sudden, and, and, and I call you. I, I just don't. Hey, look, man. That press got to play you. Please, Cowboy, defense, special team. Hey, we need to get a lead. Oh, boy, if this if this game get tight and you got to make throws, uh, very crucial throw during this game, that press guy, can you come through? Can you come through? Can you come through? Can you come through? But this is, hey, like I said, we're home, man. That Dak Prescott was an MVP candidate. CeeDee Lamb and Dak Prescott and Jake Ferguson, hey, this should be a cakewalk against the 9-8 uh, Green Bay Packers team. Coming in here, payback from Aaron Rodgers, who beat us all the time in the playoffs. We had Dez Bryant. Then we got Dak Prescott, Rick of Season, beat us, and, 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 and uh, two kicks by the kick across. But, it's, hey, uh, that curved in. That just, hey, I don't know what happened that game. But, hey, payback. 
This could be a payback. This could be payback. Green Bay Packers. This, hey, we, this should be a payback. We should beat the brakes off of them. Beat the brakes off of them. Hey, because I believe in that defense. Defense doing their job. Defense doing a hell of a job. Hey, John Lewis. The head, hey, the man is trying to ball. John Lewis. He's showing little signs. Uh, he, he 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 getting back all more healthy. He ball was ready, but uh. It might be a little too late for John Lewis. I think he, he got to have an awesome playoff to get paid. This is the last year with the Cowboys. So I, I like how he balling. I like how he balling. Donald Wilson had a pickoff the other day. The other day. Donald Wilson had an interception. But, hey, man, that was against Sam Howell. Sam Howell. This is the playoff. This is when you can't, you can't miss no coverages. You can't, you can't blow no assignments. You can't do nothing because a big play will end your season. No mistakes alive. No mistakes alive. No more excuses. No more excuses. This is what I'm talking about, man. This no no more excuses. When we lose, ain't no excuses. That press guy is about to be one of the high-paid NFL players in NFL history. If he, if he can get to the championship game or he get to the Super Bowl, if he gets Super Bowl, oh my God, it's gonna blow. Hey, man, you about to break the bank? It's over. With. It's over. It's over. It's over. That was Jerry Jones want to see. Just like Michael Irvin said, it's on the offense. Defense are doing their job. We holding these guys to, to down to 20 points. Be good high off high scoring offense. It's on the offense. The offense is on you. You got two home games. You got the gift of gab. The NFL gave it to you. They gave you the easiest path it is to the championship game. They made Jerry Jones a big amount of money for the, the next two weeks, the next two home games. The boy, the Cowboy Pride ticket is going to go through the roof. Through the roof. Thank right, Prescott. What you going to do, baby? If you were that once time MVP candidate that we thought you was, it's time to put up. It's time to shut up. And I can't wait. And you're going to hear some more of me from uh, Thursday and Saturday. Hey, this week is playoff week. Wild card round the Dallas Cowboys and the Green Bay Packers. Boy, this is going to be good. I can't wait. Hey, man, hit the subscribe button, man. If you're new in here, if you're new, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Share the video. Leave me a comment down below. Uh, and tell me what you guys think, man. Until the next time, it's your boy M. Breezy. I'm out. Here we go. Here we go.